Hey Taurus, so this week we are fresh off the back of that big Scorpio full moon eclipse that we had last week which was very intense for a lot of people, specifically for you guys because obviously Scorpio is your opposite sign. So you might have had um, quite a lot of intense emotions last week. And so this week we are feeling a little bit more sensitive than usual. We have got Venus moving into Cancer, which is going to make us really focus on self-care. So this week it is very important for you to listen to your needs um, and to really communicate your needs as well, because uh, obviously Venus rules relationships. And so if there are any relationships where you actually need to communicate your needs a little bit better, you need to say to somebody, hey, I'm, you know, this is what I'm feeling and I'm feeling a bit sensitive or this is what I need from you or this is what I need to do for myself, then this is going to be a really important week for you to do so. Uh, it might feel like, you know, a um, little bit of a kind of touchy subject. You might feel a little bit reserved, like you don't want to have to uh, put yourself out there and communicate your needs. But it is a very important time, especially with Venus in Cancer, to take care of yourself and to really prioritise your nurturing and your emotional uh, stability and the way that you feel. So let's see your cards for this week. Okay, we've got the Four of Wands and the Seven of Pentacles. So these cards, both of them, are about waiting. They are about um, slowing down, with the Seven of Pentacles being specifically about patience. Uh, something is happening, but it's happening in its own time and you can't force things. And the Four of uh, Wands is to do with uh, taking a breather and celebrating you know, how far you've come or taking a break after you've worked really hard. So both of these cards are suggesting to me that this is really a week for you to slow down because because you have been working very hard, you have been pushing, and you need to really acknowledge how far you've come so that you can actually um, kind of recharge your energy for what's ahead. So guys, if you want a private reading, there are links below. Otherwise, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next week.